Happy birthday, giant tiger. This video is not sponsored in any way. I'm just a really big fan of buying groceries at great prices. And I can do that at Giant Tiger. That is what I'm doing today. They have an anniversary sale going on. You know I checked that flyer. I made my list. You guys can come with me. Let's go shopping. Let's see how much food we can get for as little amount as possible. It's that budget, baby. I think everyone's on a budget these days. Groceries are stupid expensive and we still got to eat. So finding sales is the best thing we can do. Here we go, gang. We're not going alone. We have a driver today. See that UPS truck? Some hauls are coming. <laughs> He's bringing in a couple packages now and there are more on their way. Thank you, Santa. <laughs> Okay, friends, we're back home. And if you don't know what Giant Tiger is, let me fill you in really quick. It is basically a Walmart. It is a Canadian Walmart. Yes, we have Walmart in Canada, but Walmart is an American company. Giant Tiger is homegrown. It's from right here in Canada. It's very similar to Zeller's or Kmart, if you remember that back in the day. Also, Byway back in the day, like early 90s, late 80s. The company is good, okay? I will tell you, it is not a bougie store. It is not bougie at all. Some folks call it the GT Boutique. But if you notice from any of the clips, it's not a boutique, okay? It is essentials. It is basically, if you only had a few minutes to go to one store and you wanted to shop, in Canada, Canadianly, at a Canadian store, you would pick Giant Tiger because it has everything. It has clothes, it has diapers, um, feminine products, anything for your shower, your home, um, cleaner. I really, this should be a sponsored video, but it's not. I really just love a good deal, okay? And I'm trying to help you guys know. Um, if you're in Canada and you're thinking like, I haven't been to Giant Tiger in a while. Now's the time to go because, you guys, my entire table is filled with groceries for $170. And to some of you, that might seem like a lot. To me and Curtis, 
when that total came up, and Curtis doesn't shop often, but he knows inflation is insane. It's crazy. So shopping at a regular grocery store, not a bulk food grocery store like Costco, which is where I buy the majority of my groceries. Um, anytime we walk into Superstore or Sobeys, it is unbelievable how expensive things are there. And some things you just simply have to buy because you can't find them anywhere else. And it's a necessity for you. What I'm saying is giant tiger. It might not be fancy. Okay. They might store stuff in boxes around the store, but you're paying a good price and it's not messy. It's just not bougie. They really did have some good deals on clothes, shoes, um, stuff for like spring, like outdoorsy stuff, gardening stuff, all of that. But I really was just looking for groceries today. So I didn't have too much fun. However, while we were gone, Santa came again and dropped up another package for me. So <laughs> I definitely could have um, gone through the clothing section and found some things. They even had sneakers for 10 bucks. That's a great deal. Um, but I really didn't need anything because I just did a lot of online shopping. So I behaved myself today. What's the matter? What's the matter? <laughs> You're sick of this rain, aren't you? It's been a rough couple of days for you. Poor buddy. He's still been getting out for walks, but they're not very long, are they, buds? Let me quickly show you everything that we picked up. I did show a lot of prices while we were shopping, so I won't really go over those again, but everything that I picked up was on sale, everything. And the sale prices at Giant Tiger, they can't be beaten. They just can't. I uh, got some sour cream, a big old thing of sour cream. I'm thinking about making some nacho dip. I got some Lunchables for the boys. They love these. Even though they're teenagers, they still love them. I got them three each. And then I got a couple boxes of Eggo pancakes. Um, the boys will make these before school. I mean, we can make real pancakes, but... When we're in a rush, I mean, the boys wake up like 30 minutes before the bus actually gets here. I'm not kidding. So they have like no time. They sleep in as long as possible because I think they stay up too late, but I wouldn't know because I don't stay up too late. Um, this was an amazing deal under $4 for a value size package of fries. Friggin' two kilograms. Wow. That's a great price. These cucumbers, 62 cents. Are you kidding me? And a dollar twenty-five for three very good-looking tomatoes. Honestly, if it was summer right now and we had all like the summer eats and it wasn't raining and gross out, I would have bought so much more. I would have made a potato salad, have a toasted tomato sandwich, put some tomatoes on a burger. I I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. Probably a fajita, maybe actually. But I just love tomatoes. It's just. Tomatoes are really a summer food for me, so I'm not really in the tomato season yet. Sorry, guys. I'm really weird. That was a really weird thing to talk about, but it is what it is. I got some cheese. This was a great deal. I got the limit. I got five. Um, we got some sub buns. I actually think I'm going to be making some garlic bread with some of these as well. Flip it open. Um, put some garlic spread or garlic butter on it and then some cheese, some bacon, if you're feeling sassy, maybe a little parm on top too. So good. My boys love it when I do that. Um, and Curtis picked up some brown bread. I made three loaves of brown bread last week. If you are on my Instagram, um, then you would have seen it because I showed you guys on Instagram. If you're not following me there, go ahead and click the description. Go follow my Instagram. I like to post over there as much as I can as well. Um, Curtis picked out these pizza pockets. So he got those for work. I'm sure Skylar and Cooper will have some as well. I love banana peppers. I love them on anything and everything. Honestly, sometimes I cook them with like peppers and onions. Um, when I'm making like a little stir fry, sometimes I just eat them straight out of the jar. Not even kidding. So good. I'm obsessed with them right now. Um, got some Swiss cheese crackers. All these crackers were on sale too. A couple boxes of Ritz. Um, some wheat thins. These ones are a really good deal because they have the most in them. 386 grams. There are 
let me just show you actually three packages and they're very long <laughs> sorry about that guys <laughs> the other boxes are 200 grams this one is 386 you guys so a lot of the times some stores don't put these Christy crackers on for sale um, when the other ones are on sale, they don't include these in the deal, but Giant Tiger did. So that's awesome. Um, also got a couple boxes of Bear Paws, which were also on sale. Curtis picked up some Shreddies and I picked up these Fruit Loops. I could not leave the box there. Look how vintage it is. I love it. It just reminds me of my childhood. Oh, the good old days. 12 boxes of Kraft Dinner for $9.99. That was a great deal. Curtis picked up some Diet Ginger Ale. Curtis and I like to have a beverage every once in a while. And one of our favorite drinks right now um, is Diet Ginger Ale with Crown Royale, which is my favorite whiskey. It's so good together. And we've been having it for like a few months. It actually was my sister, Kimber, who told me about that mix. And we've loved it ever since we tried it. Normally I just drink whiskey straight if I'm being honest, but sometimes you just want to have like a nice light beverage. So diet ginger ale, if you haven't tried it, try it. Curtis got into the chips on his way home. Of course, also he drank a diet Coke that we picked him up at the giant tiger, but it is not featured here on the table and that's fine. Um, we got some Doritos, sweet chili heat and sweet and tangy BBQ. Curtis loves both of these. And then of course we got the Cheetos. I really wish, um, Costco would get some crunchy Cheetos in the great big bag because Cooper and Winnie eat these like it's going out of style. Honestly, I cannot keep them stocked in this house, no matter how hard I try. Um, I got some of these little cute, Cadbury dairy milk bars to go in Winnie's lunches. I got some jumbo peanuts with sea salt for me. I love these. I really love these. I don't know how far this restaurant went, um, but we used to have a restaurant in Moncton called the Slurpin' Munch. And my dad would bring us all the time. And what you would do is you would eat peanuts while you're waiting for your food. There were buckets of peanuts on the table, which thinking now, I don't think anyone would do that because of peanut allergies, but this was the nineties. Okay. We were reckless. <laughs> um, we would go to the restaurant and we would sit down and there'd be buckets of peanuts. You would shell the peanuts, throw the shells on the floor and eat the peanuts. Actually, like when you were walking to your table, you would walk on peanut shells. I I loved it. And that's where I fell in love with peanuts straight out of the shell, especially salted. It just gives that extra. I also picked up some of these um, Super Nibs Twizzlers. These are so good. Luthia loves these. And Cooper and I really like them too. Um, Curtis picked up some gum and I picked up some of this Hubba Bubba for my boys as well. All of that, all of it for $170. That's good shopping. <laughs> that just reminded me of my father-in-law, if you know, good old Jeff. Then if you've ever eaten with him before, whoever prays before you eat, as soon as the prayer, we say amen, Jeff picks his head up. That's good praying every time, without fail, every time. Now we all say it, and it's so funny. Anyways, that's the haul, y'all. I'm going to go. The bus is about to be here. I have some fun hauls coming up. Um, stay tuned. I'm so excited. I just feel so good. I feel so good. And through the winter, I really struggled. And I think when you struggle, it makes you so much more appreciative of the days that you're not struggling to smile and you're happy and you're grateful and humble and just so thankful that you still have everything. It was just waiting for you. It's okay. Thank you guys for sticking with me. I appreciate you so much. If you're not following me on TikTok and Instagram, please go ahead and do that. Um, the links are in the description below. 
and I'm getting my groove back. I'm Stella. I'm getting my groove back. Okay. Thank you guys for being here for the groove. I'm excited for what's to come. Love you guys so much. Thanks for being here. Bye. Almost forgot you guys. $2.97. Got these for my boys. Super sandwiches. I'm sure they will not even last 24 hours, but for three bucks, that's a deal. Also, don't forget to thumbs up this video, you guys. It helps my channel out so much. I'll see you next time. Bye.